Welcome back to Madfather. We've got Mr. Spock's magical water, and we're ready to head into uh, head into the uh, portal to hell here. Jump into the other world. No going back. Let's do it. <clears throat> we're gonna cross our fingers that the last gem is in here somewhere. So she went. What will she choose, I wonder? I shall see this to the end. <clears throat> so my chainsaw and my lamp <clears throat> are gone. Hmm. This is... It's like some storybook world. Better move on. this man has committed. I don't want any more victims of his. Don't you feel the same? You lie. If anyone understood Father, it was you. It's Maria you don't like, right? You love Father, so you didn't like them getting along. I know how you feel. I love him too, so I felt like someone was taking him away. I was so scared I couldn't breathe. <laughs> What a relief. You really are our daughter. So you do get it. Yes, it's all as you say. I couldn't stand to see your father and Maria together. So you do still love father, don't you? Then why are you making him suffer? It's not that I want to make him suffer. I just don't want to give him. So I'm taking him with me. Didn't we promise? Whatever happens, we'll support him. Rest easy on him. I'll be supporting him. Eternally. In the afterlife. What's gonna happen to me? Without Father, I'll be all alone. I don't want that. I just want to be with Father and you. Take me with you, too. Please. You can't possibly do that. I want you to live and be happy. But I can't. I'm literally traumatized after all the stupid shit you put me through. <laughs> what makes me happy is being with you and Father. So don't leave me alone. No one shall interfere. Mom. Now, honey, let us go. Father. Aya. Aya. Father. Aya, why won't you listen to your mother? Don't take him away. Out of my way. No one shall have him. Mom, stop. He is mine alone. What's this, mister? Magic water. A new product of my company. The power kept within the water shall no doubt be of help to you. I can save father with this. But what'll happen to mom? If your love reaches her, I'm sure your mother can be saved. Really? I guess there's no being sure. What should I do? Grant mom's wish, or save father. Um, hmm, uh, uh, grant mom's wish or save father? Uh, you know what? Everything being what it is, I did make a promise. You know, it's kind of hard to break it. Save father. I'll save father. What are you doing? 
I'm sorry, Mom. Stop. I'm fading. Disappearing. Aya. Uh... Wait, don't go. Well, a promise is a promise. Where am I? Father. Uh. Aya? Father? I'm sorry I worried you so. Father, Mom. Yes, I know. She must have been lonely. We'll visit her grave tomorrow to soothe her spirit. Okay. I, uh, I didn't want you to know the truth, <clears throat> but with the last of my power. What? A fine sample. I shall dispose of the remaining materials myself. That can wait. Come, Maria. Doctor. The mistress is aware of our relationship. What does it matter? I don't believe she's fond of me. That is the problem. The girl will be eleven soon. It's a troublesome age, to be sure. Be kind to her, please. And ensure that she never comes to harm. She shall always be my most precious... doll... of them all. Huh? A doll? Me? Father? Was that... Huh? This is... now what? Mom! How long is he going to stay cooped up in this basement? Don't tell me he's with that girl again. Doctor, Mistress Aya has become rather ladylike. And to think she always used to make mischief and bother you. Ah, <laughs> indeed. Just a little more, I think. A little more until she's ripe. What? I want to make her into the most beautiful doll I can. What was that? She shall be the masterpiece of all the dolls I've made. Dolls? What? Make her into a doll? What is this? I shall clean up the unnecessary materials. I won't allow it. You'll never make our precious daughter into one of your subjects. What is the meaning of this? Are you planning to experiment on her? So you overheard? What are you thinking? She's our one and only treasure. She's a wondrous daughter. I want to make her eternally so. And yet she will someday be dirtied. That I cannot bear to think. So I will make her into a doll. I don't believe this. I'll never let you do that. I'm leaving. What are you saying? If you want a doll of her so badly, just make a replica. Wait. Are you planning to take her away? That I cannot allow. Let go. I won't let you do what you will with her. Mom? Lady, stay with us. Doctor, why did you do this? It had to be done for Aya's future. B but don't speak of this to Aya. But she was already feeble. Say she passed away from a fit. Deceive the mistress? I can't. Are you refusing my order? No, it's not what... Maria. Whatever happens, I am loyal to you, Doctor. That is why you are my assistant. 
Now, how shall we dispose of the body? Naturally, Aya must not see it. Mom, is this a dream? Am I just having a bad dream? It's not a dream. This is reality. I'm sorry, Aya. Your mother still loves your father even now. So I couldn't kill him. But I should have. Don't say that. Run away. Run away from him. Ah, uh, Aya? Aya, what's wrong? Why do you look so afraid of your father? No. Huh? Uh... Huh. Mother? Aya. What I just saw was true. Father, you killed her. Oh well, so much for that. Father? Well, Aya, don't you think your mother's beautiful? Yeah. I suppose you can't accept it just yet. Yet, I know you will in time. I wanted to wait just a little longer, but you're gonna make me into a doll? Don't be sad, Aya. By making you a doll, your beauty can last forever. <laughs> Look at these children. Beautiful, yes? Preserved just as they were when alive. These are the fruits of the Drevis family research. None of them are moving. Is that what's going to happen to me? Look them over from head to toe, and you can only imagine that they're dolls, yes? But their heads, eyes, torsos, hands, legs, they were gathered from a wide array of people. <laughs> I find it quite fascinating. I even tried combining a dog with a human. What do you think? Incredible, isn't it? What would you like to be, Aya? Alas, I can't make any changes while preserving your loveliness. Father, stop. And, of course, I can dress you in all the finest clothes. Tell me whatever you wish to wear. Aya? Where are you going? Come, be by your father. No. Tell me you hate me. Sorry, Father, but you're a lunatic. But I... I don't want to be a doll. Run away from insane Father. Oh, boy. Got no items. Proceed saving recommended. <laughs> it won't open. Uh, yeah. Open the door. The mannequin blocked it. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Open. Ha 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 
Hey, Brody. Thanks, Brody. There's something there. See it. <laughs> this is... Where's the doctor? Mistress. Maria, don't let her escape. <laughs> Alright. Uh, well. Let's slip through here. What was that? I saw something. I have the sneaking suspicion that uh, I missed a gem somewhere, but we'll have to see. What do I do? Where can I hide? Right there. <clears throat> Man, I hope I didn't miss a gem. Wherever could you be? Where did she go? I apologize, I lost sight of her. What? I I'm terribly sorry. I'm certain she couldn't be far. Go Let's me. search elsewhere. You're <laughs> useless. Do so much blood. Is there anything here I could use? How about some shady drugs? <laughs> Is there anything here? Bandages. You want a bone? <laughs> this should help stop the blood. Mistress, thank you for caring for the likes of me. It's fine, don't worry about it. I should be most loathen, loathsome in your eyes. Please, I... It's true. I have known how you feel, mistress. I took away someone beloved to you. Of course you would hate me. But you are very kind to show me such compassion. Maria. Can you stand? Mistress, let's get out of here together. But... I'm the same as you, Maria. I thought I couldn't live without father. But the way he thinks of us... I don't think he thinks. I think that's part of the problem. I don't want to be a doll, so I can't be with him anymore. But you and I, we both can't live alone. So, let's go together. Even if Father's gone, I know the two of us can make it. I shall accompany you. Maria. Apologies, but could I have your shoulder? Okay. still looking. Maybe go this way. Or maybe just... Oh, now we gotta go this way. Oh, okay, I see. I... I'm gonna get it. Father. Mistress, hurry. Never mind me, escape. No, we're leaving together. I can't go any further, you must escape alone. If I'm by myself, I... It's alright, I shall not leave you alone. I'll follow behind. Believe me, please. <laughs> she just kicked her on the head. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, uh, yeah.
where that door goes. What? Hi. Come be with us. Uh, no? How about no? I. Why don't you go take him? That's enough of our game of tag, Aya. I have to keep you still, don't I? Let go! Didn't want to hurt you, Aya. It's a shame. Stop, father. But I can cover your leg with a skirt easily enough, so it should be fine. I don't want this. I wanted to stay with you always. I love you. So please, stop this, Aya. <laughs> don't worry. Father and Aya will always be together now. So rest in peace. I love you. <laughs> Damn! Wow. Father? Aya. I love you. Aya. Ah! Holy crap. Father. Where, uh, all right, Maria, where did you learn to be so goddamn savage? Like, Jesus, you throw scalpels like you're a friggin' green beret. Maria. Are you hurt? Father oh, isn't moving. Did he die? I apologize, mistress. I had no other choice left to protect you. It's okay. This is for the best. I see him twitching. White I'm glad I made it. I th thought you were dead. I mean... I thought you were dead twice, all things considered. Mistress. Thank you for saving us. No need for thanks. I just did what she asked. You mean my mom? Like I said, I'm sorry for scaring you. I had no intention of harming you. Believe that, at least. I understand. Mom was trying to protect me. Thank you, Mom. I want to see her again. She wanted that, too. But I don't think she wanted to be seen as she is now. That's... Whatever Mom looked like, I... It's all right. She's always watching you. So don't be sad. If you are, it will only make her sad. <coughs> Okay. The curse will wear off soon, so it's almost fair We're going away. We're all alive now only because of the curse. I see. But there's something I must do before I go. And that is set fire to this mansion. Why would you can't do that? All those happy memories I have here. <laughs> all those happy times. Those good times of father chasing me with the chainsaw down the halls. All the monsters crawling out of the doorways, trying to, trying to gnaw my legs off. <laughs> All those fond, happy times. This place simply can't be left in town. It's possible that someone could find it and continue your father's work. We can't let the same tragedy happen again. Is that what Mom wanted to? <laughs> I see. If that's what she wanted, then do it. Mistress. It's okay, Maria. Even if this house is gone, my memories of father and mom won't go. Not without years of intensive therapy. Mistress. Yes, that's right. There's only one thing I can ask you. Do not ever forget the people who were sacrificed here. None of us had any relatives. No one looked for us. No one remembered us. No one knew we existed at all. It's as if our very existences were erased from the world. But we did indeed live, so I don't want you to forget that. I want you to hold proof in your heart that we were here.
That is the least you can do for us. I'll never forget. Thank you. Well, this is goodbye. <laughs> goodbye, Aya. May you be smiled upon. Now go. Goodbye. Come on, Snowball. Come on, Maria. Let's get the hell out of here. It's just the two of us now. Well, and Snowball. Yes, that's right. What shall we do now? I don't know. We have to find somewhere to live, but I'm sure I can't live alone. Maria, will you come with me? Yes, of course. You've done much for me, mistress. Now it is time for me to help you. Whatever awaits us ahead, I wish to protect you all the way. Thank you. Let's go. Are you sure? You won't watch it to the end. Yeah, it's fine. Father. Goodbye. Actually, I wonder where that guy in the black coat went. I kinda hope he's okay. I'm sure he'll be alright though. He's such a mysterious guy. Come on, Snowball. What do you got there, Snowball? A book? Mistress? What's the matter? Mm, nothing. Let's go. The mistress is very hardy. Even after that harsh experience, she walks on without shedding a tear. I think that's, I think because her brain is broken at this point. With the mistress beside me, I feel we can overcome anything. However, what is this uneasiness I feel? Doctor? Humans are such utterly foolish creatures. I have seen countless many foolish humans, but you are the most foolish of them all. Man, what a way to go. Burning alive in your own home slash chapel, surrounded by your chainsaw and your dolls with Mr. Spock just straight up disrespecting. A human mad with desire is more fearsome than any demon. And yet I adore such foolish humans. Come with me. If you come with me, you may research to your heart's content. Finally here. I've heard about this place. Drevis Clinic. Clinic? Yeah, this must be the place. It's out in the middle of nowhere. I bet no one even notices it. Um, hello? Ah, a patient. Welcome. She's so pretty. Is she the doctor? What seems to be the problem? Yes, well, I was born rather feeble. I usually get checkups from my local doctor, but how do I say this? My family doesn't have much money, so the doctor's given up on me. That's why I came here. I heard the doctor here does checkups for free. Yes, we don't ask any money from our patients, so don't worry. Really? I honestly don't have any, so... I can really get examined? Of course. Thank you so much. What's your name? I'm Jean. Jean Rudy. Jean, that's a wonderful name. I'm Aya Drevis. Nice to meet you, Jean. Yes, you too. 
That doesn't sound good. We should examine you right away. Come in, come in. For someone who's not all that healthy, your leg sure carried you a long way. Was it difficult for you? I met a kind old woman on the way here who took me part of the way by coach. It was so nice of her. There are some really nice people out there. Just like you, Dr. Trevis. You think so? Well then, let's begin. Now lie down here. Boy, I'm nervous. I hear horses. They don't sound far off. Are they in the back? Stay very still while, while I apply anesthesia. Ah, yes. You have very pretty eyes, you know. Oh, so beautiful, I'm almost getting lost in them. No one's said that to me before. Thank you very much. Nervous? It's fine, just relax your shoulders. Doctor. Doctor, do you think you can make me better? Of course. From now on, you'll never suffer again. Oh. Uh, so don't worry. Now go to sleep. Indeed, the mistress is much like you. It does run in the family. Doctor. <laughs> Cue the sounds of the chainsaw. Well, we missed a gem somewhere. And man, does that bother me. Um, I have no idea where it went. I'm assuming the bone does something. I have no idea what. You know, I never tried giving the bone to the dog after I took the key. If that was, if that was it, um, I don't think I'm going to go back through the like, second time looking for that gem. Uh, I need to see. Although the true ending. You gotta get all the gems for the true ending. I might go look up where the last gem is. Not gonna lie. And debate. If I do, I'm not going to film like, the whole second time going through that whole thing. I would just get the gem and then go to the end, post another video that's like, this is the true ending. Uh, oh, we got some more here. We promised. So I can't ever forget. And the promise. You know there's also what if I use the magic water on on mom? There's also that thought. Gems nineteen out of 20. Continues used 5. Hmm. Blood mode unlocked. What is blood mode? Museum. What is museum? Oh, this is just the... Gallery, characters, okay, Mr. Spock, doll maker, the hell, oh that's cool.
what is... I gotta end the video pretty soon, like, as in five minutes ago. But I wanna go see what... What is up with blood mode? What is that? Experience new terrors in a different scenario. Unlocked by reaching the true ending with all gems. Maybe we'll make some videos about Blood Mode. I'm gonna go look up what that is exactly. I don't want to spoil it for myself, but I do want to know if it's worth a whole second playthrough or not. So, if there's gonna be more videos, then it's probably gonna be Blood Mode. Otherwise, it might be just one video that shows true ending. Uh, I don't know. We'll find out. But this has been the Jaded Gamer, playing Mad Father. Hope you all enjoyed. And, until next time, take care.